Welcome to this video where I will be describing how to change an image with the click of a button. Now let's get started. To start off, get the two images that you want. So I have my two right here. And what you first need to do is you need to change the texture type. Now, a lot of the times it's going to start as default and then you want to change it to a sprite. And the fact that your two images are actually sprites is going to be very important. So make sure you do that with both of them. As you can see, both of mine are sprites. Now you need to create the canvas. So you can do that by right clicking, going down to UI and creating a canvas. Now, one really important thing is changing um, the scale to scaling with the screen. And then now we can create the image for our button by going back down to UI and image. Now, right now, as you can see, it's just a plain white square, and that's because there's no source image. And as you can see, it takes a sprite. And that's why technically these are not new images. We're just going to be changing the source image. So changing the sprite for this one image. So let's say I want to start off with the heart. So I can do that now. And there it is. I'm just going to move this down a little bit so that eventually we can have space for the button and we can create the button by selecting canvas right clicking ui button now we need to create the script so right click create you can go all the way up to c sharp script i've already created one called change image so i'm going to open that up right now now the first really important thing is this line number four you need this ui library because we're going to be using image, which is a UI. Now you're going to create a public image. And this is essentially going, we're going to set this equal to that image we just created in our scene. And we're going to create a public sprite. And this is going to be the thumbs up sprite that we want. And again, we'll set this all in the inspector. Now here is going to be our method. And so this method is what we're going to tell our button to do. So when the button is clicked, we want new image to happen and everything inside of new image. Now, in this case, we're just taking the original image. So remember, original is an image. And again, we're changing the sprite component because as you can see, when we look at the image, the source image is a sprite. So we're changing that sprite into our new sprite. Now you can go ahead and save this script. And now we can select our button and attach the script. You can really attach the script anywhere. I'm going to attach it to the button. As long as you remember where you attach it, that's what's most important. Now, again, the original image is just going to be this image that we created before. And the new sprite is going to be the second sprite. Now, if we scroll down in our button, on click. So on click, what do we want to happen? We want our new image method to run. So the, currently the list is empty. We're going to click the plus sign. We're going to select the object that the script is attached to. So I just attached the script to my button. So I'm going to look for my button in the scene. Then we can find the name of the script, which was change image, and then the name of the method, which was new image. Now when I click play, and when I click on our button, it changes to this new image. Thank you for watching this video. I hope it is helpful and you can implement this into your next project.